It didn't half come around fast, but the 27th marks the second beta of Ubuntu 12.10. I fired up a live DVD to see what's new. The most striking change when you first boot into the second beta of Ubuntu 12.10 is two new items on the Unity launcher. These are web apps for the Amazon Web Store and the Ubuntu One Music Store, the online version. Both of these open in the default browser, which is Firefox, and they can be removed by simply unlocking them from the launcher. But why are they there? The reason is twofold. Ubuntu see that these are the sort of places that users will be shopping anyway, so it makes sense to have them handy, but Canonical also get a small cut of revenue from the sale of each item through these web apps. But that's not where Amazon integration ends. In a move some have found controversial, Ubuntu have added Amazon product suggestions to the dash. So now by default, regardless of whether you're searching for an app or an actual product, you'll see a list of Amazon suggestions returned. The good news is that these are fully integrated with Unity's new preview feature, meaning you can have a good old gawp at a screenshot and read a product description before deciding whether you want to buy. But if you don't like it full stop, don't worry, it can be removed, and Ubuntu are also implementing a privacy option that will allow you to disable the feature. As with the web apps, Canonical do earn a small percentage of revenue from each sale. If you're a regular reader of OMG Ubuntu, then you'll already know about the new animations that are present when accessing the preview features in the Unity Dash. These landed earlier this week, and I have to say, they're pretty darn slick. Also marking their appearance in this release are new messaging menu icons for statuses and a remote login feature that's accessible from the login screen. To save some time, installing an application through Unity's preview feature doesn't open the Ubuntu Software Center. There's even now a feature to close windows directly from the application spread. For more on Ubuntu 12.10 and everything Ubuntu, don't forget to visit omgubuntu.co.uk.